as we all grow with information, we do better. Totally. totally. And, and yeah, we educate ourselves too. I mean, yeah. one thing RG3 mentioned is that, uh, you know, even if when we're on stream, we get something wrong, uh, we're humble enough to obviously admit the, the mistake in a future stream and update that worldview, you know, instead of wrecking people. I mean, how many people shield the, the recent uh, pickle thing that went to zero? And it would be one thing if they didn't say anything about hex, but those are the same people that are calling hex a scam. And you look at their profile, and they're showing some decentral, you know, decentralized bullshit that uh, that gets hacked. We're organic. We don't bribe people. We ain't bribing people, and they they aren't going to uh, get anything out of us. So they'll they'll promote whatever crap pays them. That's yeah. true. Well, the cool, yeah, the cool the cool thing about hacks. One thing that Richard mentioned is um, when. When someone sells their bag, they usually don't say anything good about it. Um, but in Hex, when we've got 15 year stakes, you know, Quattro Cinco's, we are incentivized to speak good about that bag instead of, uh, you know, speaking bad and having our investment go down. Yeah. You know what a beautiful thing is, is that, um, you know, uh, I, I believe that Hex was developed to drive good behavior. Um, good uh, staking behavior uh, put a put you in a different mindset. And uh, oh, cool, we got somebody else in the green room. Let him in. Um, but but when I when I looked at you know when big payday hit, I was looking at, at um, looking at a wallet, and I look at what I've staked out, and then I look at the totals, and my interest within that first year of staking has already blown up the big payday, like blew it out, uh, it Ooh. blew it away in the first year. So it's already more than the big payday. So that was just one year. I mean, holy <laughs> shit, holy fucking shit. You know what I mean? And that's, and, and that's the first year of compounding the first year of the share price where it's at, you know, without it moving first year of price, not going, you know, up yet. So, 